Welcome to Channel Today in History, in today's video we will talk about the day. November 23, 1891. Resignation of Marshal Diodoro da Fonseca, first president of Brazil. In Rio de Janeiro, on November 15, 1889, the Republic was proclaimed in Brazil. The imperial period, which began with the accession to the throne of the father of Dom Pedro II degrees, the Emperor Dom Pedro I degree, in 1822 was over. Measures such as the creation of civil marriage, the separation of church and state, the establishment of the vow no longer under income criterion, census vote, the end of the National Guard, the Republican Federative model, and the creation of a new constitution took place, among other measures, such as the end of nobility privileges to barons, counts and viscounts. The imperial family was shipped and shipped to France. In the economy as a whole, Brazil would continue to be agrarian and exporter of primary products, with coffee being the mainstay of this export, produced in areas such as the Paraíba Valley, where the so-called Green Wave would head. This circumstance would put Sao Paulo at the head of national political decisions, together with Minas Gerais, a state characterized by its strong domestic market aimed at the livestock sector. In the social field, Huge shortages persisted among the population in the educational, economic, and political fields, which motivated movements such as the Canudos War in Bahia, urban protests such as the Vecina Revolt, the Chibata Revolt, and the workers' strikes in Sao Paulo. The so-called Old Republic, or First Republic, began and ended in 1930 by the coup led by the gaucho Gachulio Vargas, who ousted then-President Washington Luis from Sao Paulo and a large coffee producer and which is normally divided into two periods, the so-called Republica da Espada, represented by the government of marshals Diodoro da Fonseca and Floriano Paxoto, and the so-called oligarchic republic, where the control of power by the army gave way to the predominance of coffee oligarchies, large families in control of the executive. The Republica da Espada was a tense period at the beginning of the republic, filled with episodes such as the aforementioned War of Canudos, in which the Brazilian army, after some failed attempts, destroyed the village of Canudos in the Bahian hinterland, made up of landless farmers and plunged into misery, led by the blessed and missionary Antonio Consul Jairo. Another critical moment would be the Federalist Revolution, which took place in Rio Grande do Sul. The first president of the Republic of Brazil was Marshal Diodoro da Fonseca, who ruled until November 23, 1891, when he resigned from the presidency to avoid aggravating the growing conflicts caused by groups fighting for control of power in the young republic. His successor was another soldier, Marshal Floriano Paxoto. Did you like the video? In the description you will find the blog link with the full article, give an incentive by subscribing to the channel, liking, commenting and sharing with your friends, hugs. Until the next.